Um, so, first off, uh, what brought you, to, or what was the most exciting thing that wanted to make you to come to Indian Hills? Uh, the, th the fact that I played in uh, this conference about six years ago, I played at Iowa Central, so when this opportunity opened up, uh, my former coach from Iowa Central uh, basically told me to go for it, and I had the experience from playing at UNI, or coaching at UNI, and playing in a school in Kentucky, so yeah, it's what brought me here, and I think they have great facilities, so I'm pretty excited to get going. And you mentioned some of that prior coaching experience you had up north. Uh, kind of bring anything from there. I uh, kind of want to bring that here as now being the head of a program. Definitely. I think that you should bring in, you know, especially with a junior college, you want to bring in, send in these girls off to four-year colleges. So I kind of want to treat it like a four-year program. So then when they do transfer, they're not surprised. So I think that's really important for these girls and then get them ready for whatever level that they're able to play at. And that's sort of your plan of attack as you approach the seasons and all the things that not only make the program better but make the players better as they go on yeah definitely i think it's really important to get these girls ready for the next level especially as a junior college four-year colleges look to you as a feeder to get these athletes ready to go in and play at their junior and senior senior years so yeah and uh the team last year uh not not at no wins uh but mm -hmm. so you said you like the talent that the team has uh kind of what do you think you can bring out of them to kind of change that record around just to make them competitive um they've They've got a lot to work on, but they know that, and they're coming out every day, and they're getting better. So they've just got to, I've got to help them build their confidence mainly, but then bring in some strong talent, you know, for next year to help rebuild this program, which is going to be the most important thing to change the culture of what's here. And yeah, that's the most important thing. And then not even really a week on the job already, you're already signing mm -hmm. a new player, uh, Amy Humphreys comes. Uh, mm -hmm. What? about her did you like and uh, what do you think she could bring in? I've actually signed six players. Oh, okay. um, so I've signed four from England, one from Australia, and then uh, a local, well, she's not local, but she's from the Cedar Falls area, so where I formerly coached at. So I've signed six of them. I think a lot of them bring great talent. Um, you know, I'm talking to a couple of players from, from Spain, hopefully another one from Sweden, and then hopefully another Australian as well. So hopefully to bring in a lot of talent from all over the world to really change this culture of this program straight away. Uh, that's really exciting for me, uh, especially to get some internationals, to give them the experience that I had, I think is really important. So. And then the season's months away at this point, mm -hmm. but uh, kind of what do you want to focus on to get ready for as you uh, get ready, get acclimated to being here, and then obviously with the players as well, uh, with the season coming up? I think uh, right now it's just getting these girls where they need to be. You know, there's probably been a lack of structure over the past few years, so getting them used to what a college team should be like, um, but they're adapting well, so then hopefully when the freshmen come in next year, they'll be ready to go and they'll adapt just as well. So, yeah. You mentioned maybe a little lack of structure, maybe because there hasn't been an official women's head coach, but you're the first one. Kind of mm -hmm. how special is that too to add to it? Uh? I think it's pretty. It's uh, it's really uh, an honor, you know, just to coach in the same conference that I played in, so I have a good background of what's going on, and then. Yeah, it's, just, it, it's nice to be able to be in charge of your own team. So, yeah, it's good. All right, thank you. Yeah.